In life, there always seems to be a journey, a starting and an ending, a path with twists and turns through it all that eventually lead us to where we're supposed to be, so long as we keep moving forward. In that road, however, well, it can shape us. It can make us endure the things that we need to in order to become all that we were meant to be. It sometimes even causes us to look back and remember once upon a time when we said those fateful words. I will never do that. <laughs> yeah, like ever, ever, never. <laughs> See, our kids have begged us for years to get a dog. And we were like, we already have kids. Yeah. We have five of them. Mm -hmm. We don't need anything else to take care of. Right, exactly. We have a bird. That's plenty. Yeah, yeah. So no dog, guys. We yeah. love you, but no. And then something happened. Okay. It, it kind of came at us in subtle ways. Yeah. First off, the kids were like, could we? I mean, maybe? And I'm saying no, no way, no, no, right. no. Right, no guys, no, no. But Delin took the guys on a date one night, and during their date night, they decide to stop by a pet store. I mean, they're so cute, why not, right? So she sends me this video. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he likes your chew. And so I'm like, what are we doing? What are, what are we doing here? I know, but all that cuteness <laughs> into one little fluff ball. I mean, I was like, oh. Oh, oh. So she started to melt, like literally. And, and look, the dog was cute, right? There's no denying that the dog was cute. But I still was like, what are we doing? Why are we at a pet store? Yeah, we were just going in for fun. But then the boys kind of fell in love with that little fluff ball. And the ball just started rolling from there. Keen took like this special initiative to be like, I want a Pomeranian. Yeah, and went on like research overload. It was as if he was like writing a thesis paper. Right, <laughs> research after research and was just inundating us with all of this information about getting a Pomeranian yes. puppy. He came to us very seriously and said, I will take responsibility yeah. if you will just meet me and do the unthinkable. <laughs> <laughs> that you said you would never do. Please, please, mom, please. Yes, and then this happened. Well, we're coming to you live. We have some news to share. Some big news. Some, yeah. some news that we never thought that we would do. I thought I was done with this part of my life. Uh, and I said I would never do this. However, when your children look at you with those puppy dog eyes, yep. and they have begged you for years to get a puppy, and when the puppy looks at you with those puppy dog eyes, you melt into a puddle of mush. Not only did we say that we weren't going to get a dog, not because we don't like dogs, but just because we already have kids and... Chico. He had a bird, and so like... There's a lot know, of responsibility with a dog. Our cup is full. Yeah. But I also said I would never own a little dog. Right. I wanted a Great Dane. Like, I've always dreamed of having a Great Dane. And then... Hey, you. If you have ever been paying attention to this channel, you know that we love us some Dutch Bros, right? I mean, we drove 146 miles for a cup of Dutch Bros coffee. True story. Dedication. So we thought we would celebrate after we pick up the new pup. So us Dutch lovers mm -hmm. figured what better way to celebrate this Christmas miracle? <laughs> we had to celebrate. Dutch style. Yeah. We're celebrating Dutch style! Yay. <laughs> oh Do you want a little treat? You want 
Oh, she likes the whipped cream. Awesome. <laughs> yes. Total score. Because hey, y'all gonna have to be bringing her by. Bring her by and tell us when we find out her name. Yes. I know. We will. Do you have any name suggestions? Oh gosh. Like I said, anytime I see a dog that's like has like the brown like streaks, I think cappuccino. Oh, <laughs> that's nice. fun. Keeping up the coffee love. That's yeah, fun. Love. Oh, don't forget our stickers. Not only did our puppy with no name yet get to experience Dutch to celebrate today, we got new stickers. <laughs> Did she like her treat? Oh yeah. Very much so. So Lily, what do we think about Lily? I was kind of close to Layla. I know. And that was the girl's suggestion. At Dutch, I mean, come on. It'd be like the ultimate hat tip to Dutch bros if an employee names our dog. I know. I mean, come on, man. We support the Dutch on this channel. <laughs> you hearing me? You hearing me, Dutch bros? We support you on this channel. <laughs> we might even name our dog after one of your employees. So as you can imagine, a family of seven has all different kinds of opinions of oh, what man. her name should have been. I mean, there was lots of names in the running and thanks to Dutch bros, Lily, who works in the uh, Northern Arizona Dutch, we got her name, Lily Pup. Yep, Lily Pup. It's perf. And so Lily Pup literally just like day by day, step by step, moment by moment, just worked her way. <laughs> Her cuteness, <laughs> her fluffiness, right into our hearts. Overload. Ah, she's amazing. Like we couldn't have asked for a more perfect dog. Yeah. She yeah. is so amazing and you're gonna get to know her and you'll fall in love with her too. But there was definitely one person <laughs> we were not sure. It wasn't love at first sight. That's for sure, let's just say that, okay? <laughs> Chico. It could have been love at first bite. <laughs> <laughs> so, you know, our little bird, Chico. Um, I'm pretty sure that, you know, he was kind of acting like that firstborn child that's like, hey, wait a is, minute. Who is that what coming the? into my house? This is my territory. That little fluff ball S walking around. Step off, you little cotton ball. <laughs> <laughs> so. It took him a little longer to warm up to her. It did, but eventually. Like with us, Lily worked her way into Chico's heart, and now he spends his time grooming her hair. Yeah. <laughs> What's going on there, guys? What you guys got going on, huh? Chico's grooming Lily. We all have a new year in 2021, so there's lots of good changes coming forward, and let's make the most of it, do the best that we can. What we have, right where we're at, make everyday life beautiful. Woo, that's a take. That's a wrap. her and then she does this thing with her ears watch collar really oh hi lily <laughs> how can you not love this cute little face right here she's so sweet she's so cute she's like gonna be she's just gonna be the star everyone who's told us that a pomeranian is crazy oh this is her chill Behold, Lily Pop! <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, let's go get her some food. Look how fluffy. Oh. She's like a cloud.
The only little baby we're ever going to have. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but it's Kian's, so it's not even ours. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, it's Kian's. <laughs> yeah, this is totally Kian's dog. Merry Christmas. <laughs> yeah, make no mistake, this is Kian's dog. Kian's dog. dog. <laughs>